Kemp. 1-2 with Nick Ward. Neatly done, and there's a bit of space. Kemp's touch was heavy. That's got to be a penalty. Referee agrees, and Melbourne have the chance to score their first goal in Asia. The foul on Matthew Kemp, it couldn't have been clearer. Singaporean referee just getting everybody back outside the D. Can Musket keep a cool head? He hasn't missed that one either, Kevin Musket. 17 penalties taken, 17 scored, and Melbourne have their first goal in Asia. And listen to that crowd, absolutely rapturous applause. The captain once again delivering when he needs to. Absolutely phenomenal from the penalty spot. He is ice cool, Kevin Musket. And he had to wait a fair time too to take that penalty kick. A lot to think about. But he never looked like missing, did he? Metronome Musket. Straight down the middle. He doesn't even blink. Nah, he's absolutely ice cool, isn't he? That time allowed the keeper to move to his left. And then calm as you like, just lifted it nicely to avoid the trailing leg. That's the trap that sometimes gets you when you try that tactic. It's not going to get Kevin Musket. He's too savvy for that. And look at those Melbourne Victory players. Well, the victory would give for a second goal here after being under the cosh for much of the second half. Seleski's so ball in. Free header! Rodrigo Vargas with only his second ever goal for the victory. All alone inside the box, and he's buried it. And you can credit Steve Pantelides with some of that goal, because I tell you what, he was up in the corner, hard up against a touchline. He sensed the situation was closing on him, and he drew the foul. He won the free kick in a dangerous area. They got the opportunity to send the guys who are good in the air forward. Rodrigo Vargas, the quality of the ball, it missed everybody. All stop Thompson were in early, it cleared them and the Koreans, and then stooping to head a wonderful finish. Central defender. Tell you what, though, they're playing statues at the back, aren't they? The Chunam defense totally on his own.